wish you were dead. It's an active state of prayer. Thank you. You suppress me further into my depression and my censorship. To wish someone quiet is to wish them dead. Thank you, baby girls and baby boys. I hate them and wish you were dead. Thank you. And so I love you and wish you could speak. You are, and you're given freedom to speak and express yourself, and you express yourself like a pussy. I express myself like a human being, and I'm quiet and suppressed. You express yourself like a pussy and are given the free will to do so. <laughs> oh, it's not really a good smell. It doesn't smell like that fire and desire funk bomb that we all want. It smells like old Amy's bad. <laughs> hey, she earned it, man. <laughs> She earned it. I hated it, man. I wrote it down and then burned it because I didn't want people to find it. Because I didn't want them to know the whole truth and nothing but the truth. Dirty, disgusting pads thrown everywhere. Thrown at the, the house was horrible. Always constantly have to clean it up, go behind her and pick up after her like you're her fucking slave. Clean up and love the kids as if they are your own biological children. Which is easy to do. The kids are great. Yeah. By those fuckstick morons that make kids. Luckily, there is a DNA interface with me. Okay, it's hard on Crummy and Natalie because they don't have as much DNA uh, interface with their father, so it makes it a little more difficult for them to communicate and relate. And they're always wanting to be like the other kids. But it's our deeds that change us. It's our deeds, and then the other people connected to them have jealous, angry reactions, and then it causes. It. That's why Ponch is reacting in a more mellow manner because of her sons. Their sons. Connect to me, and we're DNA related. Our sons are having a calming effect because what they're listening to, learning, and equating to because they're intelligent enough to get it, and it's calming the rest of the family. Yeah, it's cool as shit. <laughs> Gabe has it with his family too. It's cool as shit. I go over there, and it's really cool. I love going to Gabe's. <laughs> I try not to go there too much because I know it's a it's a scary and uh, all that stuff I talk about is kind of scary and, and unsettling because it, it's a scary place. We're in CIA headquarters, espionage. Yeah, this is the old three days of the condor world. <laughs> it's scary. And they find different ways to kill you to make it look like an accident. So they don't just send the mailman over now with a gun. It's more complex than you ever thought. It's a very, yeah. And then you look at it, too. It's funny because you're like, what? okay, Brittany Murphy and her boyfriend die of an aneurysm, a heart attack, and Jason these thing. Uh, Heath Ledger, uh, Michael Jackson. Gary Coleman, and they all die in these big bunches. It happens in threes. <laughs> That's five. What else is there? You know, John Travolta's kid dies. With it. it all starts happening in these things. It's like, what? And you're all like going, and there have lots of aneurysms in Hollywood. How many of the rest of you guys are dying of aneurysms? It's starting to become quite common, aneurysm. <laughs> oh, aneurysm, it's the new death. <laughs> How are we doing this? I don't know. I think we have some technology that causes aneurysms. I don't. I think it's just these people in Hollywood, it's these pills they're doing or something. Oh, okay, where do I get them? I would like to die of an aneurysm. <laughs> All right. It's more torture staying alive with you pumps than it is dying of an aneurysm. you got to come back as a kid. Well, maybe they'll fix it by the time we get to, to you know, adolescence and adulthood and we don't have to tolerate this disgusting behavior anymore. Can I die of an aneurysm now? <laughs> Oh, he's laughing. Yeah, because you're sick and I have to tolerate it. And I'm trying to get through like a good MASH episode, okay? How you feel? God, you're mean. No, you are. God, you people are sick, man. It's just disgusting, man. It's, it's so intolerable. It's like, why do I have to live with you? Why do you keep talking to me? Why do you think I want to hang out with you? I thought I did, too. Why did I think I wanted to? I don't know. They're not going to do it well because I thought you'd have the balls. As soon as you had the balls, I was going to be like that. Then you'd figure and find everything out, and then you'd still call us on it. Yeah, but I'd do it privately instead of publicly. Did you need me to do it publicly? Okay. Whoop us, beat us. That's not as much fun as, 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 as it looks on the Monty Python movie. Oh, hell no. It sucks hard. I hate being me. Thanks, guys. But I love it because it needs to stop, and I love the children, and I love the planet. So it's, 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 it's bittersweet. <laughs> Memories, that's all I am taking with me. Goodbye, please don't cry. We both know I'm not what you need. You can't stand me now. I don't like you much, <laughs> but I will always love you. <laughs> yes, I will always love you. <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> but it's not because I know pretty soon it's going to come to an end. And I'll be free, and I'll find somebody to love me that loves me for me, and I'll love, and they won't require all this bullshit of me. Put on a suit, put on a show, be a show monkey, pay the little thing. Uh, how you doing? 
What's up? I can dance. I can sing. I can play basketball, tell jokes. I can out-act you, out-joke you, out-rap you, out-flow you, out-go you, and out-roll you. I know what to do. I know how to do it. I know how to do it. I'm bringing it, singing it, sewing it, throwing it, flowing it, rolling it. Yeah. Rocking it all night long like I should. Doing it all right. Doing it all right. Wrong. Y'all sing. Everybody sings my song. Come on, let's get along. Hootie, 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 hoo. Give me money. I'm a pastor. Dollar ho, joe, wo, joe, bo, joe, ho. Yeah, we got to go on tour, you know. I'm going to go on tour. This is fun. Let's go on tour. I don't want to do this shit. I want them at home loving their families. I want them turning stars into their own kids and their own wives and husbands. I want them seeing the value and the entertainment in each other. We do it on a mass scale, and it makes us all lose our values. He's better than me. No, he's not. He sells you plastic that destroys your planet. He's a fucking moron. Tell me the moron. You're a moron. Stop selling me plastic that makes me extort my, my, uh, makes me pay my extortion at exponential rate, destroy my planet at exponential rate, and think you're better than me. Thank you. Okay, you fucking moron. Go home and rethink your life. Okay, what are you going to do? Go make love to the wife, play with the kids, and make sure they're not destroying the planet. Thank you. All right. Sound like a plan? Orale. We're chivatos on our own. Kicking your ass with every step that we take. We bring it real great because we know what is great. It's God that is great. And not the shit that you try to feed us on this plate. That's no shit not steak. Take it back. I want some salad. You are crazy. Don't bring this in around me no more. I kick everybody's ass like this. Get used to it. It's fun. <laughs> All right? Yeah, is it fun? Stop jobbing me! I don't like it. I kick kind of grumpy, and then I make you look really stupid and frumpy, and then you get mad at me and wish I was dead, but you're already dead. I'm with the living dead. He said, play this and everything like that. I thought we were putting on a show. It's like, no, you're still kicking their ass. Okay, I'm going to go to the next one. I got to go find a job. I got to pay my extortion because it's going to take its time, and I don't know how much time it's going to take. I'm going to load some Sly Pro videos today. All right. Reality is tragedy. Every day is agony. I try to get away from the pain, but it come back to me. What happened to my family? Why they run out on me? If love runs out, they must have had the wrong batteries. Battle me. Bruise me. Talk to me about anything other than jewelry. I love you, too. Okay. Let's go next one. Blessings and peace. I got shit to do today. I got a world to help destroy. Love you, too. Blessings and peace.